Hello, this is Broyer, and welcome back to another episode of Let's Play Farming Simulator 19. We are finally ready to harvest our wheat. So, uh, let's get this going. Go ahead, we'll go ahead and, uh, just because I think they do a better job, we're gonna go ahead and hire a worker. We're actually gonna slow down the speed all the way to one. Why not? And let this guy start harvesting our wheat. Uh, also, in the meantime, I have, let's say, I parked this guy over here. I don't know if it'll fill up automatically. We do already have two boxes there, but I'm just curious if it'll put it in like whatever trailer I have over there or not. It might not. i am also got a worker over here um, plowing out this field so that I can plant some wheat here. And since the other two are getting, you know, harvested now, we'll be able to plant all of them at the same time and all of them will grow at the same time. Which I think is going to be a really good thing for us. We'll just, we'll just do non-stop wheat for now and kind of go from there. One of the things with going for the wheat, though, is that we will at some point, like in the very near future, in fact, actually right now, come to think of it, we will need to get a baler um, and bale up the straw that hopefully this guy is leaving behind, which he may not be. Why are you not leaving straw behind? Um, okay, wait, wait, wait. Smith worker, come on. Um, enable straw swath. Okay, so that's fine. All right, a little bit of a mistake. Uh, I, I don't. I mean, I don't think we lose the straw. I just don't think it puts in a nice pile for us. Okay, see now, now it's in a nice pile. Okay, that's fine. Uh, I think the straw is still technically there for the other stuff. It's just spread out a bit, so I don't know how easy it is to pick up, but. That's okay. The, the, the swath is now going and we'll be okay there. So what we may do is go get this guy to go pick us up a baler. So let's go ahead and head out of there with our tiny little tires, <laughs> which are awesome. And see if we can go get us a baler. Although I may need to go get... Actually, what I'll do is go get the baler. And then when we get back, we will probably... Empty out a little bit of that grain so that we can go feed the chickens as soon as possible. I think this thing looks so goofy. With these tall, skinny tires. But they serve a function, so. We haven't technically made any money yet, but hopefully we're getting there. And obviously, if we keep using workers, we're going to make it last money. But, you know, chickens is where going to be our money's going to be. So, I think it's okay to hire a few workers for the uh, the fields themselves. I mean, I don't think I've turned a profit on any days yet, right? Not quite a bit of loss so far. Especially even today. But I haven't sold anything today. So, we're going we're gonna to be able to sell some, some, uh, some stuff. Hopefully get our chickens to do a lot more eggs soon. Now, I don't know if they... I know they have the re reproduction cycle for the eggs, but... I assume they eventually make more chickens as well. Or maybe the eggs are separate from the chickens? Um, let's see. Yeah, yeah. Okay, so we have chickens now. So we're already at... Uh, we've actually got a bunch of eggs, too. We're at uh, 31 chickens now. Nice. I mean, it's not a lot, but technically it is growing without me having to pay for it. Alrighty, uh, we're over here, uh, so we do need to get a baler. Um, not that, I want to go with this. So we need to go for a baling technology. And, I mean, I would love... It doesn't tell us what kind of bales it makes, does it? Pretty sure this one makes rolled bales, which is fine. Um, so it can ferment into silage. Well, I don't want it to turn into silage. I just want it to be convenient bales. 
And then I want to pick up said bells at some point. Oh, this is the bell trailer, um, which does is able to hold round and square ones. I mean, the round one is the cheapest, quite frankly. Um, is there a... Uh, isn't there a thing, thing that does like all... That was the TMR thing. Yeah, I don't know if there is something that just does hay bells and stuff. There's the mowers, but that's always not what I'm looking for. All right, so bailing technology. I mean, I like this one a lot because it does spit out a nice little square, like as you go, but kind of expensive. So I think we're going to have to go with the round one for now. Plus, this one uses a not as strong of a, a tractor. So I think it fits us a little bit better. And it's going to be okay. Uh, we'll set up wide tires or regular tires. I don't know if there's any reason to have the wide tires, so we're going to go with regular ones. And uh, is there any reason not to just lease this thing? I think we just lease it. Because I don't think it's going to get very much usage, so I think that's going to be fine. And this little tractor should be plenty powerful enough to run this thing. I and mean, obviously we'll also have to come get a, uh, a way to haul this bales around. Which is what the other tractor will probably do. Is we'll probably get a little fork and a lift on the front of the other one to be able to come out here and, uh, or not come out here, but go out and pick up the bales of hay and move them around and do stuff with them. See, I don't know if this thing has to have it in the little rows or if it can pick up from the stuff that was just scattered accidentally at the beginning. I guess we'll find out. Worker's finished yet? Probably the guy that's doing the uh, plowing is finished. Uh, I don't know that I doubt the guy that's doing the harvesting is finished yet. Yeah, the plowing guy looks like he is done. Harvesting guy is. Uh, still moving. Harvesting guy G. Now this one, the other one, the, the square baler, will automatically deposit, you know, the bales of hay as it goes along. This one you have to manually tell it to go. But it's okay. It will still work. Alright, I don't, again, I don't know if it'll work without the little swath, but we shall see. We technically know there's a bunch right here, because we can kind of see it. Let's back up a little bit. Alright. Come on, little dude. Can you do your thing? Um, lower pickup. Turn on bailer. Are you going to pick stuff up? Negative. Alright. And if I come over here, you will pick this up. Alright, so it does pick this up. So in a sense, I mean, I could come back through and I could stack that other stuff up with a different tool, but honestly, it was just one little path. I, I think it's just, it's not going to be the end of the world. Um, okay, and turn it off so I can turn around. Turn it back on. It'll start beeping at me once it gets a little full. Right, let's back you up. 
And I'm looking for unload baler. And it pops a little, a little round bale of hay. All right, can we? I don't think we can hire a worker for this. I think we actually have to do this one manually. Which is fine, this isn't too bad. Do I want to get one of the other workers doing something while I'm doing this, though? Um, I do need to get that other thing ready. So let's swap over to you. Um, no more chicken eggs yet. Uh, you. You. I've already got that ready. So if we go back to our fields, we can see that that is now cultivated. and But it does not have fertilization yet on it, which is fine. Um, so what we want to do is, and it doesn't need plowing or anything like that, which is good to see. So what we'll need to do is um, probably go ahead and fertilize first, and then we'll we'll drop some seed down. So let's go get you the fertilizer. So we can have you doing your thing while the other one's doing its thing. Nope. Not too far. Grab you. I got a little bit of fertilizer left. Not a ton. But I think it's enough to get through this. I'm going to kind of get you close to the edge. And hire a worker. Oh, really? Hire a worker. There we go. Cool. Alright, back over to our truck. Is it turned back on? Turned on. more. There we go. Back up. Unload. Oh, back up a little bit. Oh, it kind of went over. Overshot it a little bit. Come on. Come on. There you go. This thing goes pretty fast. And a load. Fold it back up. And keep going. Where's the little guy over there? He's almost done doing the last path now, and then we'll move him over to the left the other field. We'll be able to sell this hay for a little bit as well. So that's one good thing about wheat is it's like double dipping. Looks like our other guy is actually full up right now. All 
All right, so what we'll do is we'll come over here and we'll back you up real quick. And let's swap over to you. I don't think any of the eggs made a difference. Um, but for now, let's get you up here. You can move up and drop the, or bring the, the trailer over for now. All my other guys are doing something. Actually, what I technically could do is have you... F uh, you know what? I'm going to see if it works. Let's see if you can fill up a little bit. I mean, you're not going to be able to fill up much, but if you can get a little bit, and then I can just take it over to the chickens real quick. That could be nice. I don't think it technically lands on the ground. I think it, if I'm, if it, if it goes, it's going. So I think it all did go inside my, my trunk, if you will. All right. So I think I just have to come over, whoa, over here, to fill them up. It's gonna work. Uh, right mouse button plus Y. Yeah, it's going in there. Perfect. That's this little guy's really good. All right, so if I go to here, after it says finish the saving content, go look at my aminals. I can see that they have a little bit of food. Not a lot. I mean, I could definitely give them more, but I think it's enough food that they're going to be able to start being more productive at this point. So, good to see. We'll definitely bring some more food over at some point. Kind of want to back you back over here to the eggs again. Just to see if it does anything. It may not. Alright. Let's get out of there. Um, let's go to the other tractor. Let's see here. You are completely done. Um, so I can get you started on the next part. But you are going to need to be emptied for real. Uh, how are you doing? You're done. Okay, so actually what we're going to do is grab you. <laughs> Which buttons to push? We're going to have you go get the trailer. Mostly because I want to leave my uh, little car over there to see if it can, if it does automatically fill it up with eggs. I don't think it will, but we won't know till we try. Okay, we're going to come over here. Drop your fertilizer, which we accidentally use that much. It does go a long ways. Not to be perfectly lined up, but <laughs> I still want it to be. I'm gonna come over here, back you up here. Come on, grab you. Come get this guy emptied off out a little bit. And this thing can only hold 4,000, so it's not going to empty it up all the way. But it'll empty it up quite a bit. And you pipe out. I'm going to say, is that barely in line? So we don't have quite enough space in this one tractor to hold all of the of, of a single field so it's interesting to know which it does tell me i don't know if it's just wheat, wheat itself is a higher yield or if it's because of all the fertilization that we did that we got out here yield or maybe it's a common combination of the two but we were able to fill up like it was less than half it seemed like we're just barely even half of the tractor on the soybeans and stuff all right so pipe back in our thing is full this guy's still got some you know, it's not quite uh, emptied out, but emptied out enough that we can get him started. Alright, come on. Line you up. And hire a worker. And uh, please tell me you need the straw thing. 
Yeah, okay, good. I was like, I don't think I have to keep doing that all the time. I think it's just once I've set it up, it stays. All right, are you... Yep, Baylor's turned on. Actually stayed on the whole time, which is fine. So I think I need the other guy doing it. Actually, it probably is. Probably need him doing some seeding and stuff like that. I mean, I'm still going on the slow speed, so we should be fine for now. Oh, there you go, you did get filled up. Technically, there's a little drip of it still there. Okay, 50. Hey, it counts. He's got a pretty good turning radius, I'll give it that. I mean, I may only get like a hundred dollars a bail or something like that, I honestly don't know. But, that's still something. Finish this up, and then we will probably put cut in there. Two more, two more paths. I don't know if we'll have exactly enough for a whole hay bale over here, but we'll get pretty close. And if not, obviously we got the other field as well. I mean, if I got $100 a hay bale, I got like 800 bucks here. Which doesn't sound like a lot, but kind of in this game, it, you know, it starts to add up after some point. I wish the workers could do this part. Not that it's hard, but... Come on. I can't hire a worker, can I? It's just after a while, once you get to some of the bigger fields and things, it's going to start adding up, sure. Well, not quite a full one. Is there some left over there by any chance? Or did I get it all? I think I got it all. Hmm. Oh well. Almost full. If I'd gotten, obviously, that path over there on the far left, or on the far side, I should say, that would have finished up. Uh, you know what we're going to do? We're going to go ahead. I said I was going to call it there, but I'm going to go ahead and finish this thing off real quick over here, just so I know that it's done. Oh, he's a little sliver. There we go. Alrighty, well, we're going to call it there for now. How many pay bills are we end up with? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10 if you count this one, which I will count this one because it, it technically it was mostly that other field. So 10 hay bills, not too bad. We probably would have gotten 11 had we done that whole line there as well. 
fact, I can almost guarantee we would have, so that's not too bad. And so if we get another 11 or 12 or so from this one, I think this field is... I can't tell. I think it's a little bit bigger. So we might get, you know, 20, 30 bales out of all this. Um, not 30, but probably about 25 bales maybe, max. If we had that other field over there that we're going to turn into wheat, you know, I'm talking maybe 40 bales, maybe 35, something like that. It's not too bad. Um, let's swap through things. We don't have any more eggs yet. You're ready to go deposit somewhere. Don't know if I want to deposit you over by the chickens or not. But, you know, we'll figure that out next time. I'm going to go ahead and put a cut in here. I do appreciate you watching, and I hope you join me again next time. Thank you, and goodbye.